What happened to Wendy Williams? What happened to Wendy Williams? Let me Google, what happened to Wendy Williams? I'm pulling it up right now. Wendy Williams diagnosed with frontotemporal dementia and aphasia. I don't agree. They gave her the pills. Wendy Williams was a sacrifice. Wendy Williams was a sacrifice. I don't believe that. Wendy Williams was a sacrifice. Wendy Williams was a sacrifice. She was a Hollywood sacrifice. They talking about she got dementia and aphasia. Wendy Williams was sacrificed. And even though she did a lot of Negro pen I still want what's best for my sister. I still want what's best for my sister. Wendy Williams was a Hollywood sacrifice. Ain't no way in hell you're going to tell me that she got dementia and aphasia. She only 59 years old. I'm not buying that. I'm not buying that. Wendy Williams ain't got no damn dementia and aphasia. They gave her the Hollywood cocktail. They gave Wendy Williams the Hollywood cocktail. My prayers go out to her and her family. Get well, Wendy, and come back as a black conscious journalist. Get well, Wendy, and come back as a black conscious journalist. Get well, Wendy, and come back. I wish Wendy Williams a speedy recovery. She wasn't doing nothing productive. I agree. She wasn't doing nothing productive. I agree. But as long as we still here, we got a chance to change. As long as we still here, we got a chance to change. As long as we still here, we got a chance to change. I wish nothing but the best for Sister Wendy Williams. They gave her the Hollywood cocktail. They slipped her a Mickey. Ain't no way in hell she got no dementia and no aphasia. Aphasia is when you can't articulate yourself verbally. Aphasia is when you have trouble comprehending what you hear and what you read. Dementia is a loss of brain functioning in at least two major areas. Judgment, balance, speech, reason, emotion. She might be, I hope she's not mentally brain dead. I hope Met Wendy Williams isn't mentally brain dead. I hope Wendy Williams isn't mentally brain dead. Has anybody seen Wendy? Has anybody seen Wendy? Somebody got to go check on her. Because if she's dementia and aphasia, she might can't talk for herself. If Wendy Williams has dementia and aphasia, she probably cannot talk for herself. If Wendy Williams has dementia and aphasia, she probably cannot talk, brothers and sisters. She probably can't talk. Stay away from them Hollywood demons. That's why I'm not dating no Hollywood sisters. I'm not dating no Hollywood sisters. The family doesn't know where she is. She's in a guardianship. Somebody send me some links on the Wendy Williams. Somebody text me some links, please. 215-989-9858. Text me some of this information on Wendy Williams. I might have to do an analysis. The family can't contact her. She was abducted by the power structure. She was abducted by the power structure. Wendy Williams was abducted by the power structure. What Wells Fargo got to do with it? Wells Fargo won't release her money? What the f We're going to have to go get our sister Wendy Williams. Find her where she at, and we're going to break her out a side of Shakur style. Find out where they're holding Wendy Williams, and I'm going to get all the brothers together. We coming strong. We're going to break our sister out. Aside of Shakur style. Find out where Wendy Williams is. You said Wendy Williams is the real life they clone Tyrone? Wendy Williams is the real life they clone Tyrone? Somebody said Jamie Foxx is the real life they clone Tyrone. 
Somebody said Jamie Foxx is the real life they clone Tyrone. Where Puff Daddy at? Did they get Puffy? Did they snatch Puffy? Is Puffy Combs all right or did they snatch Puff too? Somebody said they snatched Puff. Did they clone Puff? They froze her $40 million. You know how many FDMGs I could build with that $40 million? You should never take another brother's queen, my brother. You should never take another brother's queen, my brother. I can't, I can't support that. You should never steal another brother's queen. I don't support that. Respect the sanctity of marriage. Respect the sanctity of marriage. And women shouldn't be stealing other men. Women shouldn't be stealing other women's men. Women shouldn't be stealing other sisters' men. Ladies, y'all gotta stop doing that. Black women, too many of you are home wrecking in the black community. Can any of my sisters identify? Black woman, has your husband been stolen from you by another black queen? Has your home been wrecked by another black queen? Where my sisters at? Where my sisters at? Do you have a sister actively plotting on your king ladies? This is why the black women can't work together because y'all too busy stealing each other's men. This is why black women can't work together because y'all too busy stealing other women's men. This is why black women can't work together because y'all too busy stealing other women's men. You can't relate? Yes, you can. Y'all say y'all don't want polygamy, but y'all will, will share a married man. Y'all say y'all don't want polygamy, but y'all will share a married man. Y'all say y'all don't want polygamy. So why are you sharing a married man? If you don't want polygamy, why you take that man's husband, that woman's husband? If you don't want polygamy, why you take that woman's husband? Don't be a hypocrite, ladies. Don't be a hypocrite, ladies. Don't be a hypocrite, ladies. You anti-polygamy, but you sharing a married man, a married man. Make it make sense. You anti-polygamy, but you sharing a married man. Hit the cash app, dollar sign FDMG school. Hit the cash app, dollar sign FDMG school. Hit the cash app, dollar sign FDMG. How you talking about you against plural marriage, but you sharing a married man? This is ridiculous. This is, polygamy is poison, but adultery isn't. Polygamy is poison, but adultery isn't. You say polygamy is poison, but adultery isn't. I love you too, my sister. All unmarried women are my wives. You are my spiritual wives until you get married. I'm responsible for you. All fatherless black children are my spiritual children. We got a bunny hopper. Holly Berry said, who gonna stand with Dr. Umar and not vote this election without some promises? Who gonna stand with Dr. Umar and not vote this election without some promises. Who gonna stand with me in the Bishop Turner Black Political Union? We not voting unless we have a face-to-face -face with either candidate and they make some campaign promises to black people. Who's standing with me? Who's standing with me this election season? He got Kamala Harris running around trying to get the black bourgeoisie to manipulate you into voting on in November. Joe Biden and the Democratic Party plantation got Kamala Harris running around black America. They got Kamala Harris running around black America. 
They got Kamala Harris running around black America trying to get black people to vote for Joe Biden. These people didn't lost their damn mind. These people didn't lost their damn mind. These people didn't lost their damn mind. Talking about if you don't vote, they're going to let the immigrants vote. They're going to let the immigrants vote anyway. You don't need to vote. You need unity in organization. You don't need to vote. You need unity in organization. I keep looking for solutions that don't involve organization and financial sacrifice. That's the problem with black folks. I keep talking about some, what's the solution? 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 The solution is organization and financial sacrifice. That's the solution. I'm about to do my black queen retreat. I'm doing a retreat just for black women. I'm doing a retreat just for black women. I'm doing a retreat just for black women. It's going to be the Queens and Dr. Umar. No other brothers are allowed on the retreat. No other brothers are. It's a political retreat to organize. A secret retreat with the black Queens and Dr. Umar. Who coming, ladies? Who coming to the secret retreat with Dr. Umar and the Queens? Sign up is coming soon. Getaway weekend. Secret retreat with Dr. Umar and the Queens. It's going to be a for sisters only book release retreat weekend. It's going to be a for sisters only book release retreat weekend. It's going to be a for sisters only book, re book release retreat weekend. Now nah, Shaquille O'Neal got to stop thirsting for them bunnies. He thirsted over uh, Britney Spears. Now he thirsting over Taylor Swift. Shaq, I need you to calm it down, Shaq. Shaq, I need you to calm it down, Shaq. You're you doing too much bunny thirsting. Shaquille O'Neal be doing too much bunny thirsting. First he thirsted over Britney Spears back in the day when he was in the league. Now he thirsting over Taylor Swift. Your husband ain't gonna let you come to the Dr. Umar book release retreat for sisters only? Well, I gotta respect my brother, that's your husband. If your husband don't want you around the Prince of Pan-Africanism, maybe he think you a little thirsty. Your husband might think you a little thirsty, sister, I don't know. Have you went outside the relationship before? Have you went outside the relationship before? Maybe that's why your husband not comfortable sending you on the Dr. Umar for Sisters Only book release retreat. I can't, I can't, that's my brother, you his wife. So if he don't feel comfortable with you coming on my retreat, I gotta respect your king. That's your king. That's your king. I'm gonna, I'm gonna co-sign him. There's a reason why he don't want you coming on my retreat. You might be a little thirsty. You might be a little thirsty. Okay? You might be a little thirsty. You might be a little thirsty. I'm rocking with the husband. It's all about black king. It's all about am I my brother's keeper? I'm a big believer in am I my brother's keeper? Dr. Umar is a very big believer in am I my brother's keeper? So if her husband don't want her to come to the For Sisters Only book release retreat weekend, maybe he think you're going to let yourself your shango stick down. Maybe he think you're looking for the shango stick. I don't know. 
Maybe he think you're trying to put that put the shango stick in the honey dip. I don't know. Who is Mick Cannon? I thought his name was Nick Cannon. My brother, can you spell? Yes, me and brother Nick Cannon talked about his cereal bunny hop. When he dropped the episode, you're going to see what he has to say. No, it ain't going to be freaky because I'm staying in my room, ladies. Y'all not going to get me on no quid pro quo. Y'all not going to get no TMZ footage off of me. You out your damn mind. When you come to the For Sisters Only book retreat, book release retreat, I'm locking myself in a room outside of the seminars. I'm locking myself in a room, ladies, outside of the sessions. You ain't bringing your center buns to my room and try to get no TMZ footage on me. Oh, no. I know how the game go. You're not going to bring them center buns to my room and try to get no TMZ footage on the prince. You must be out of your mind. You must be out of your mind. It's consciousness over the cookies. It's politics over the punani. It's revolution over the romance. It's institutions over the intimacy. It's business before the... Oh, no. No hair weave on a book retreat. You can't come. I don't want to see that. I don't want to see that. If you got blind, you're not coming to my... You're not coming to my my for sisters only book release retreat. You're not coming to my for sisters only book release retreat. The shade room is waiting on updates from the Dr. Umar for Sisters Only book release retreat weekend. The shade room is shady. They got me on TMZ. How I get on TMZ? I'm not no damn celebrity. What am I doing on TMZ? I'm not no damn celebrity. What am I doing on TMZ? I'm not no damn celebrity. You need female security. Okay. Who want to be part of Dr. Umar's internal security? I'm going to have an all-female internal security. Any ladies good with security? Physical and digital? I need an all-female team. Security, physical and digital. I need my Dura Milaj. My own Dura Milaj. 